What's up everybody, Big Ox Triple Six here, the Golf Gamer. So check it out, I'm going to show you guys a huge bug that's in Dragon Age Inquisition. So check it out, as you see me turn the camera and as you saw that character Josephine right on her desk, this part right here is supposed to be a cutscene going on when I sit on sit on a, on a throne. And yet you see the same character right there. This part I was supposed to judge like 10 people, I, I think I judged like 3 or 4 so far. But yet that that cutscene is pretty much you know there. It just stopped. It just got me out of it. And also I go sit on the throne, and it takes like three to four minutes just to load up. And this part happens right here. And this supposed to be a cutscene. It took me three days, like seriously three days, to I had I had to cut the time on here just just for you guys because I don't I don't don't know what to say for like three uh, three to four minutes long just talking about nonsense but yes I had to cut the time on here for you guys and it, this crap happens now I don't know how in the hell this game got eight and nines I don't know how in the hell it got eights and nines I have no idea no freaking idea but they need to do better on EA Bio Bioware, you guys need to do better on this game. I mean, on on next Dragon Age game and next um, Mass Effect Andromeda. But I put at least it's, that's this is an old save. I put at least close to ninety hours into this game, and you're probably like, Big Ox, that's 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 really really a long freaking time. Yes, that is true, but the way they execute it is it's bad because you go around pretty much collecting stuff and that's not always a good thing especially on each map that's pretty bad and also um another thing i need to talk about this freaking story like seriously it's just you know it, it will let you try to let you transfer all your save files from Dragon Age 1, Dragon Age 2, all the way to Inquisition, but I couldn't couldn't do it. I didn't check check how to do it on YouTube and I still still won't let me do it. And the thing of it is, when you go to each area, which I'm gonna pretty much try to show you guys um, what you usually do, each map, all that area right there. You see the stuff you have to have to collect. You have to collect the distorted fades, all that area. You have it's a basically collected on, and it's in each single section. You have to collect stuff over and over and over again, and it's annoying. And the reason why I kept on doing this because because the um the battles I enjoyed the battles, but each freaking area you you go to, it's the same freaking thing. To destroy the bit, um, help somebody out, um, collect this, collect that, over and over and over again. And I did it because I, I had that 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 mind just like try to collect this and try to collect that over and over again. It's, it's, it's just a habit to me because I mostly pr prefer to play the single the single player. Um, prefer to play the side missions before I I even start the main missions, and that's that's how I am. But yes, each area is basically the same freaking thing. And all that stuff, I had to go walk around to unlock that stuff on a map. So yeah, it was annoying. And that's why I put so many hours into it. That's when everybody say, oh, I put 90 hours into it. Yeah, because you walked around collecting stuff. That's basically, basically what it is. Now, I'm pissed off of the story. Let's just say you never played... Um, Dragon Age 2 DLC. You'll be confused of what's going on because I was kind of shocked because I played the Dragon Age DLC. It's better than this right here DLC. Hell, the Dragon Age 1 DLC is better, better than this whole game to be honest because something happened on Dragon Age 2 that you defeated and that person comes back and he's your enemy on this one. Somehow he just comes back and he's your enemy on this one. And I'm just like, what if no I thought in my head like, what if nobody played the DLC? How in the heck they gonna they're gonna figure figure this crap out? Like seriously. And 
your character is supposed to get imported from Dragon Age 2. The character that you see see um, um, talking to is the uh, champion of Kurtwall, which is from Dragon Age 2. And I wanted my character to transfer to this game, which would be pretty, pretty freaking cool, but it's the thing's messed up. And you're probably saying, well, Big Ox, this is an old freaking game and stuff. Yes, you could say that, but I played Red Dead, Red Dead Redemption, the first one, last year. And I give that a, a freaking 8, a solid, a solid 8. I mean, the controls were bad, but it was still a great game compared to this one. Dragon Age 2 is a better game than this one. And also, the romance um, stuff on here, it's like dumbed down. On the second one and on the first one, you you have um, more a chance of have, being romance and also getting achievements and trophies for it. On this one, you don't. It's like they watered this freaking crap, this this game down to like it's nothing. And it mostly preferred on the multiplayer. I haven't played the multiplayer, but from the the people I heard from that I work with that played the multiplayer, it's like Diablo three just just pretty much with waves. That's basically basically what it is. And Bioware, this, I shouldn't, well, no one knew what was going to go on with Mass Effect and Drama because that was years, 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 you know, past when this, with this game and stuff. But, man, this game is so freaking glitchy. It's not even funny. I literally, like, jumped in the air and pushed X to t talk to people, and that person was still moving in midair just talking to that guy. And I was just like, man. EA, Bioware, y'all freaking rushed this game. I'm glad I paid 20 bucks for it. Use, jeez, man. And I got the season pass online from somebody for like 15 bucks. But man, oh my gosh, this game, man. It, 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 it hurts my soul because I love Dragon Age. I love the first one and I love the freaking second one. It's like the first one, then the second one, and this one's just like, whatever. The characters... The characters I like Sol Solus, I like Sarah, I like Blackwall, um, Iron Iron Bull is pretty cool. Um, who else? Varric, Cassandra, those are characters I like. Everybody else, like Vivian and and Dolus, and they're they're not entertaining. They're not you know, um, how can I put it? Their their story is just like, like okay. It's, it's basic. And they have all these other characters just pop out of nowhere. Like, hey, I'm here. Nice to meet you. Oh, hey, I'm here. Nice to meet you, too. Go do something for me. Go do that for me. Go do this for me. And just, like, overwhelming of all this stuff all at once, you know? And that's why I can understand people didn't like this game because they, it didn't feel like a Dragon Age. This doesn't feel like a Dragon Age. It, it feels like a watered-down Dragon Age. Like, really, really bad. And I heard that... Um, EA and Bioware was used in the Frostbite engine f for this, but you can tell this game's been rushed, and I'm afraid that the next Dragon Age game, I know it's probably like a couple years years um, later on, that they're supposed to do Dragon Age 4. And everybody's saying it might be like Anthem. Remember Anthem? People, Iron Man suit flying around and stuff, and you know how Anthem Anthem sucked? It's probably like games, games Anthem with dragons, that's supposed to be, be like that. And this one just like, the game, I keep going playing the game because the battle system is great. It's, I didn't like the battle system for um, the first Dragon Age, but I like the battle system for the second one. And they kept that, and I enjoyed that. But um, what else I was about to say? The battle system and the, the loot, oh my gosh, the loot is so freaking amazing on this game. It's so freaking amazing. Because you get so much loot on here and customize your weapons with schem uh, schematics. And those are, are freaking amazing too. Especially if you get the good stuff. The really, really good stuff. And, you know, it just sucks because I, I really want to enjoy this game. Because it's, it's a Dragon Age game and it's 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 horrible. It's, it's one of the worst ones out of the group. And they add politics in here too. And, ugh, I don't want to deal with that politics. I'll try not deal with that stuff in real life. You think I want to put it in, my, in the freaking game? Nah, dude. Nah. Nah, that's 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 a huge, huge disappointing thing. Mm -mm. Don't like it at all. And what else about this game? The loot's good. The 
battle system is good. And that's about it. And it just sucks that they just like, here you go, we're going to just put, talk about the story. It's like, here you go, we're going we're gonna to fight this enemy again just because, you know, you kill him once, you can kill him again. That's basically from so far what I played in. I, I'm not, I'm right now, I'm playing the, like, um, oh, not the Hawken DLC. And I got the, the Trespasser DLC, which I'm going to play, play those two first. And play the, play the main story. And also, Morgan, from the first one, it's in here, but you don't get to play as her. She just at your, at your keep. And... Talk to you. That's about it. You don't get to play as her. Same thing, uh, Liliana. You don't get to play as her. Even she didn't. Get, you didn't get to play as her in the second one. You know, and, and it sucks. But um, I'm so disappointed in this game, man. Uh, like I said, it's, it's. I don't know how the fuck it got eights, eights and nines. I have no, no idea. No idea. No idea. And it just drives me up the wall that people people praise this game. This game's not that good. Bound by Flame had a better story than this fucking game. Bound by Flame. And everybody gave that game a freaking like uh, four or five. And I enjoyed it. Sure, the, the game, the gameplay was freaking bad. And the AI system sucked. It died every, every two hits. But the story was still good. And the characters were better than, than these fucking characters. And this is a triple A fucking game. That gave, gave that game a fucking seven. The, man. I'm so I'm sorry about this guys, but it's just EA Bioware, you guys need to do better. You guys want want people to actually buy your shit? Do better on your games. Don't be a uh, microtransaction your 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 consumers because they won't like it. And don't tell tell the freaking, you know, your your Consumers to fuck off. If you, if you don't like the game, don't buy it. Well, they're going to go to somewhere else. Or buy the motherfucking use. Okay. <sighs> Man. It just, it just sucks because, you know, they did Mass Effect Andromeda. That, that's supposed to be a horrible game. I don't think my, even, even my friends finished the fucking games yet. A uh, co-worker of mine haven't finished the freaking game yet because the story sucked. The story's not that good. You know, when Mass Effect, Mass Effect, Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3, the second one's my favorite because I put like freaking like 100 hours into that game because I got so involved with the characters, man. The characters are so freaking cool. And, you know, and they come out and bring Mass Effect and drama and this Dragon Age. But, you know, the original Bioware people are not there anymore. And they don't have that, that st story-driven stuff anymore. And that's not cool. I wish they they come back, but EA they always prefer that money and microtransaction and loot boxes. But anyways, oh, rant's over. I'm gonna try to finish this game. I, I tried to finish this game, you know, wanted to finish the game a long time ago, but collect a ton. I, I have a habit of collecting stuff, but I'm gonna keep on playing it until I finish it. Then probably go to Final Fantasy 13 2 and then Persona 4. Try to finish those two games off and stuff. But anyways, this is Big Ox Triple Six. Y'all stay awesome. And yeah, lovely, lovely thing. Bioware, EA, you guys need to do better. Seriously, do better. But guys, I'm out. Bye.